Pinterest is a visual discovery app. Our mission is to help people discover and do what they love. We have over 175 million monthly active users with a pretty large user base across the world. To give you a sense of our scale, people have collected more than 100 billion pins of highly personalized content and that size is growing every day. I'm Sri Guru. I'm an engineering manager at Pinterest and I lead a function that we call Protect. So the mission of Protect is to protect the Pinterest brand and pinners from unsafe and uh, you know, bad content and bad experiences. As with any popular platform, there are fraudsters and spammers that come in to meet their objectives at the expense of the user experience. So it's important for Pinterest to quickly detect and shut down the bad elements in the ecosystem so that our good users have a great user experience as they are discovering new ideas on the product. We see some of the classic uh, spam uh, attack vectors that any other company might see. For example, with the registration, you could have uh, malicious actors registering hundreds of thousands of accounts and uh, using them at a future time to dump a bunch of uh, malicious pins that are pointing to unsafe sites. Oftentimes we see spammers uh, introducing pins that might look like uh, coming from a brand that you love or trust but is actually taking you to a site that is selling fake versions of that brand. We also see account takeovers. Uh, where good users' accounts get cracked and taken over by bad users. Finally, we also see exploitation of user notification by spammers creating tantalizing profiles and following other people so that they draw attention to their profiles and then lead to eyeballs on their inventory. In the Pinterest case, uh, our core strength is content understanding to find spammy and suspicious and low quality content. At the same time, DataVisor focuses in a very content agnostic manner on detecting abusers, uh, on detecting people that are abusing the platform or using the platform in a manner that's not fair or human-like. DataVisor is the first unsupervised machine learning technology company that is in the business of fighting spam and fraud. They prove to us that they are able to do that at scale and do a really good job of improving both our coverage and speed. For example, they found several accounts that were sleeper cells, which is accounts that were posing as good accounts but were several weeks, months or days old uh, that were being harvested to turn them into spam accounts. This proved to us that DataVisor's unsupervised machine learning technology could not only detect ongoing attacks but also attacks that were incubating over a long period of time pretending to be good accounts. DataVisor has provided a boost to both our spam coverage as well as spam detection speed. On the coverage front, after DataVisor was integrated Integrated, we catch about 80% of our high-risk spammers right on the day that they sign up. On the speed front, we catch 99% of our spammers about seven times faster than we did without DataVisor. DataVisor works very closely with our anti-spam teams. The DataVisor UI presents us with a lot of insights and analysis into the types of patterns, spam patterns that are occurring on our platform, which is really very valuable for our operators and analysts. We'd like to think of DataVisor as an extension of the Protect team. DataVisor is helping us bring in additional signals of high quality. The first and foremost advice I would have is get your metrics and KPIs in order that represent the volume of spam or fraud on your platform and the impact that it is having on your business or product metrics. I would say for small and growing companies, uh, it's important uh, to evaluate buy versus build and partnership options. You may be at that point where you're better off having an expert uh, company do all the sophisticated spam and fraud detection for you for a reasonable fee while you focus your energies on your core product. My message to trust and safety leaders uh, in larger companies is there's a great opportunity for you to influence the way we are organized as a community uh, by potentially sharing data or knowledge broadly with industry so that we come together and fight spam and fraud as one unit as opposed to each of us doing this individually at our own cost. Mm -hmm.